Okay, everybody, it's beer time again. Yeah. Happy 4th of July, everybody. Yeah. I only realised it was in the Benz Day just a second ago when it's I a, listened to Man Devastation Radio. It's a special holiday we celebrate here called Getting Rid of the Horrible Colonials Day. Yeah. Basically, on this day in uh, 1776, we got rid of this horrible, horrible Rich. place that just, it was just annoying us. And we just like, we was like, yeah. Uh, we, we were like, what we're doing the rest of the world, do as we say. And yeah. they said, no, we're not going to do it. So we just went, sorry then, you stay on your own. We don't, yeah. we don't, we don't nothing to do with you anymore. Yeah. <laughs> that's that's my version of events anyway. Yeah. Right, so that's we've got beer nice. again. Yeah. Beer and stupid chat is what we've got today. So we've got some step into liquid black IPA. Do you want to check out the thing and see what the, um, yeah. the theme is? Summer Adventures. Maybe that's the Joy theme. And our, our beer Ooh. room with great outdoors. City of Cake. Chocolate oh, fudge glasses. cake style that might have milk in it. Yeah. Let's, we'll see when, when it comes to it. City of cake. We're having a Sunday kind of like evening booze up today. Yeah, we went to do it last night, but we completely forgot. Nothing to do with uh, senility or anything, is it? Is it? I, I don't know. I was just <laughs> watching football. Yeah, uh, daily haze APA. What the hell is an APA? Uh, I've seen an APA before. Oh, did it say uh, it was... It's probably just American Pal out. Oh, yeah, yeah, probably is. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Which means it'd be. be... You'll have to read that later. It'll be inferior yeah. then, probably. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, they've got the independence now. They're fine. I, I know. We, 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 we just said, no, we can't bother with you guys anymore. You, Japanese? You're on your own, we said. You're on your own. You, you try and play it that you, you want some kind beer. of war. But it was just like, no, you're on your own, guys. Right, originated yeah. from central China. That's Chinese. Lumpy little orange. What? Okay. Okay. okay, we'll find out. We'll read that. We're yeah. not doing it now, anyway. We'll yeah. do it later on. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Yeah. Oh, two snacks. Tappy's con olive. Snack crackers with olives. That won't be for you. <laughs> no, I'll eat them. Oh. They're like a cracker. I like though. olives. No, but it'd be just being a cracker yeah, one. I'll try them anyway. Yeah, yeah, you might like you What's know. the other thing? Love corn. Love corn stuff. Mm. Very nice. Right. Two snacks. Uh, That's the first one. Yeah. Snacks. Elevation Pale Ale. Yeah. I think they've done that because they know that we do these shows. <laughs> yeah, I don't think so. Yeah, no, <laughs> they do. Right. Yeah. Two Chefs Brewing. Another ha two chefs. hazy IPA. It's very IPA strong. That's the summer adventures, yeah. isn't it? It's like, you must think it's not hot. We've not really been hot though here yet, have we? So this is probably like good beer for, for hot weather, but we've not been too hot. Not for me, not super hot. Uh, Docker's not, Hook. Not Canadian Ooh. hot. Robust coffee porter. Oh, lovely. Mm, that could be... To be fair to B52, though, uh, and when I, when I send my shows, our shows to them, mm. and they do reply and say... Oh, well, you've been doing them every time. Yeah, so still, still, still I'm catching up and catching up because I stopped for uh, a while because I was not drinking, ooh, was I? Raspberry Stout. Mm. Raspberry Stout. So we've got three stouts anyway. Yeah. Well, might be Rasmus interesting, Raj, with that. Might be nice, like, fresh kind of, you know, Raj, Yeah. It's a bit in. <laughs> yeah. So that's the beers. Yeah. We're going to bang them in the fridge. And uh, for you, it'll be straight away. But for us, it'll be about an hour. We'll come back and, uh, yeah. and partake of the goodness. Anyway, back in a minute. Yeah. Hey everybody, it's beer time. It's beer o'clock. They've been they've been calling off in the fridge. Yeah. And uh, looks like we're starting with this one because it's the first one. It's the raspy engine one that we just saw. Oh, okay. So we're starting off with a nice dark yeah. beer. Raspy engine. Yeah. I've got a bit of a raspy engine. It needs lubricating. Oh. Mm, I need to lubricate my engine yeah. with some raspy engine. <laughs> so it's summer adventures. This right, you've got me to read it. Yeah, you read it. Right, so let me pour them. Right, yeah. So this is the uh, jumping hops. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's find the wheel then while Elric pours. Yeah. I will find the wheel of information. It's just a bit of info in the can, yeah. quite a bit actually. Raspberry engine, old engine oil infused with fresh raspberries. Old engine oil, did yeah. you say? Yeah, okay. Uh, we've taken our <laughs> iconic craft stout, old engine oil, which right. I haven't heard of. Not but, heard of it, yeah. No. yeah. And added a wee bit of sweetness. Mm. Well, a fair few punnets of raspberries, to be correct. Uh, yeah. The result is a beautiful, rich, sharp, and fruity stout, all thanks to the seasonal instinct of our master brewer. Okay. 
We source the raspberries from Pitamar Fruit Farm. Which, Tormy Fruit Farm. Yeah, oh, yeah, Pitamar yeah. Tormy Fruit Farm, which is a small family run farm situated in the heart of northeast Fife, Scotland. I think that's pretty much what it says here, actually. Yeah. We re recommend you drink uh, r uh, raspy engine at room temperature to Oops. taste the beauty. What? What well, room temperature is it? Oh, I don't care. We put it in the drinking, we put it in the bloody well fridge. Oh, I don't care. About it's that a bit late like now. I'm yeah. not going to wait for it to, car to cool down. Yeah. I mean, to, to warm up. Is this room temperature? It's bloody freezing. Well, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, if you like this beer, try our base beer, uh, old engine or well, they always say, um, yeah, uh, room temperature. I feel, I, hours, I feel, not always, no, quite not the hours we have. They yeah. say, they say, but most of the time, it's think. the first time I see it saying room temperature, yeah. to be honest. Best served that room temperature contains barley and oats. Yeah, I don't think I've seen one saying room temperature before. Oh, I don't okay. remember seeing it anyway. I always say, like, no, I'm gonna, there's different, different in mm. like once it's six degrees, once it's seven, once it's eight. It's only like you're gonna blink it and get it to exactly that temperature and then drink yeah. it, is yeah. it? It's like bloody hell. Depends how cold and hot your room is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. exactly. Just gonna, just gonna, well, anyway. Smell. Right, so this is for looking at the wheel. Yeah. Um, there's something else for me to say. This um, strength is 5.3%. Raspberry stout, the wheel uh, is malty, sweet, and mouthfeel are all, no, so a, a four. Oh, yeah, it's the weird. Malty and sweet are four. <laughs> yeah, and fruity is four. Yeah. Then we've got three for mouthfeel, three for floral, three for bitter, one for hoppy, and zero for sour. Yeah. Right, so there you go. It's the, it's the new, slightly more complicated yeah, yeah. I don't know why right colour is deep brown it's got fruity tart and roast, roasty on the nose yeah. and malted barley roast barley and oats uh, yeah basically wow. what's, make, what's making up for it sweet and malty. yeah I'm not too sure I'm, I'm mm. going to enjoy the sweet raspberries it's like mm, I'm not massively yeah. f fan of fruity beer yeah. but uh, we shall see I actually I think I might like it because I've got that. I, you know what I really wanted the beer last night we yeah. forgot we were going to do these last night originally. And yeah. I was sitting there going, oh, man. I had loads of beer. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, well, you lucky. I've still got some leftovers. Yeah, I thought I saw some beer in there. Yeah. So it's probably best that you didn't do these on top of what no. you already had. Right, bottoms up. Yeah. Oh. Doesn't smell of um, severe I've got to even, I've got to even smell it. Yeah, yeah. Doesn't really smell. Can't smell anything. No, and it doesn't really taste a bit of raspberries. It's, it's got not subtle, really, it? Yeah, it's, yeah. It's, I was I'm pleasantly surprised mm. actually. I thought it was going to be like really overpowering sweetness, and it's going to make me want to go. Eh. It's really no, it's, yeah, nice it's got it's got a nice little mm. crisp kind of raspberry kind yeah. of note to it. But you've also got the maltiness as well, haven't you? Smoothness as well. Mm. Yeah, it's actually quite nice. Mm. And it's still got that um, kick as well. Like it's got quite a sort of alcoholic kick to it as well. Like you mm. can taste it. Yeah, it's five point three. I I thought it would be one of those ones that would like um, you know, half a, half a glass. You like, oh my god, my mouth yeah. hates me now. My mouth is wondering why I'm doing putting myself mm. through this. But no, I, this is actually hasn't even got a bad twanging to it, has no, it really? No. No, I, I was always a bit hope, going for it. I was but... always hopeful, being that it was a stout. That it was, yeah, it would come good. Yeah. But, um, you know, Ooh. raspy engine, mm. money. So it's old engine oil, which I've definitely heard of. It's the um, I've heard of that brewery, Harvest Sound. I'm brewery. sure I've heard of that. Old brewery. engine oil is quite famous, isn't it? So it's probably. Uh, yeah, I, don't I, remember, I can't say I've heard of old engine oil. Oh. Not really. I can't. I can't say oh. any confidence. Well, I've so heard of it. Right the, the location is Alva. Is that somewhere Near in the UK? Fingers. Well, it said is five it Scotland. Oh, did it? Right, okay. So Alva. I was thinking it might be an island, Alva, for some reason. Yeah. But, yeah. Okay. Old engine oil. Might have to look up from oh, near the northeast Fife. That's quite northerly, isn't it, Fife? I don't bloody know. Geography's no good. But the beer's good, anyway. Mm. That's all that matters. Fife the beer is, is a lot better than my geography. Yeah. Central <laughs> Scotland, I think. Yeah. I wouldn't go as far as say four on the fruit even. It no. definitely has got fruit notes, but it's like a much more subtle yeah. than a four suggests. Yeah, I don't think it's that fruity actually. No, no like, I if you tell, if you didn't know it had raspberry, you wouldn't know. Yeah, maybe yeah. not. No, it's definitely got that kind of fruit acidity, like a slight mm. acidity kind of fruit. Yeah. You know, 
I could definitely yeah. get that feel, but you might put that down to the Mooks, though, I suppose. Yeah. If you didn't know it was raspberry, yeah. you might just think, oh, that's the Mooks. The Mooks have got a strange... I don't, I don't think I would taste anything with lesser fruit. No. Taste beer, you know. Yeah. Like, yeah. You're probably right. Yeah. And it certainly hasn't got a strong fruit tart roast. I mean... Cheers, uh, Jenny. Yeah. Or Jean? Jenny. Jean. I don't know if it's Jean or Jeannie. Jeannie. Jenny. <laughs> Is it a bit tart from the raspberry? I didn't find it overly no, tart, to be honest. Not really. It's got a little bit of a sort of sweetish kind of, maybe sort of slightly tart train to it. Yeah. But nothing that's like overbearing. And when I saw that, I might initially, I thought, oh. I kind of also thought when we got it out first, I thought, well, we'll get this out of the way. Hopefully, we'll have a nice yeah, one later. Yeah, yeah. 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 I know sometimes the first beer, it always gets like the benefit of the doubt because they're so, yeah. oh, it's Genie that runs your beanie. Right, Genie Beanie. Okay. <laughs> Ranger, Genie, Genie Beanie. Genie Beanie. Right. Um, I'm very keen on Genie Beanie. She, oh, comes yeah. into my, uh, she comes onto my chats and leaves comments. <laughs> oh, we're all keen. We're, we're all keen on Genie Beanie. We're all keen on Genie Beanie. Beanie. She's not a meanie. She's not a meanie. <laughs> <laughs> and she's keeny. Mm-hmm. Uh, mm. uh, <laughs> yes. You must have liked that, Mum, because you've drunk it before. Yeah, yeah. I, um, just so that everyone know, if you're not drinking it yeah. before, I'm very rarely drinking it with Graham. <laughs> right. We've got a, a daily hazy APA. Oh, happy uh, 4th of July, by the way, oh, yeah. um, uh, Jeannie and anyone else. Oh, and um, yeah. Frugal Mama. Celebrate us leaving you alone. Yeah. <laughs> we celebrate here, too. We call it Go. Kicking out the Americans Day, we call yeah, it. Yeah, we celebrate by yeah. roasting an American on a spit note. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, no, yeah. Right, what was that one again? Daily. Daily. Yeah. daily. Yeah. 4.8. Yeah. Hop, hop rate is 17 GL. Hop rate? I never heard hop of that. Hop rate, yeah, never heard of that before. No, I've never heard of that mentioned before. Uh, is that something to do with... That's got to be something like that, like that kind of stat on there. It's got to be for the real worry. neaky. You know, yeah. It's got to be for the really neaky, like yeah. um, beer fans. Man? You know what? I don't think this is in here, you know? Is it Czech, this stuff? Because it's, it's, uh, it's like Polish or Czech on the yeah, right end, doesn't yeah. it? Um, hazy APA. Hmm. One of the beer features that we pay a special attention to is drinkability. Hazy APA perfectly fits this idea. Light, refreshing, strongly fruity, no pressure. Yeah, I just going to read it because I was trying to find out what country it was. And also, um, I don't think it's in the book. Oh, serious? Yeah, I, don't, I couldn't right. see it. I couldn't see it. Yeah. Another one and not in the book ones. Um, raspy Engine. Wild. Look at the pictures in here. I don't recognise half of these pictures, you know. No, no. It's going to be one of them. I don't recognise that, that. No. That, that. No. Is that one in there? I think that one was in there. Yeah, I don't That know. one was in there. Yeah, that is. I don't remember, to be honest. But um, I think you're saying we could have one of them uh, weird One of them boxes. weeks where we haven't yeah. got hardly any of the stuff that they say we've got. No, you just right, yeah. pour it, man. Pour it. Come on. Yeah, yeah. yeah pour it. Yeah. It. <laughs> really awesome. It's not going to pour itself, you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yeah, no, it's not in here. It's not yeah. in here. So we can't, anything, nothing much to say about it then. No. Is that what's in there? Oh, it's very hazy. Yeah. It's definitely got that hazy. That's exactly what it says in the tin. Yeah. Okie dokie. Wow, look at that. Oh, going to get me a beer yeah. and tend to the barbecue. Oh, cool. Yeah, that's what we need, a barbecue, man. That would be handy. Yeah. That would be nice if we had a barbecue. Have a great show. See you in comic land. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, this this looks horrible. Mm. It looks like um. It looks like, that, who was that going anyway? That was Jeannie. All oh, right, Jeannie Beanie. She's she's gonna cook some um, barbecue. -y. barbecue. <laughs> that looks that looks really nasty. I mean, I know they've got these hazy ones. It's just looks it's really it kind of like your, your typical stuff. Mm, Ingredients yeah. is water, barley, Ooh. malt, wheat malt, oat flakes, wheat flakes. Okay, wheat malt. So it's a mixture flakes. of oat and wheat then. Yeah, hops. Thick secret, whatever that is. Oh yeah, I've got uh, a feeling. No, that's the hops. Lemon drop, yeah. mosaic, these are oh, all like hops. Rocks, Citra, really. okay. Amarillo, mm. Syrian Cardinal. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven hops. Wow. Um, that's a lot of hops. And yeast is London Fog. London Fog. Yeah. Um. Mm. Smells quite nice. I don't know. The smell to me, 
fruity. Uh, well, I wouldn't say it was fruity. I don't think it tasted not particularly fruity. Yeah? It smelled, well, well no, not chemically, but I wasn't too impressed with the smell. It was like kind yeah. of like sus. wasn't like a, a, a great nose to it, but it was like, um, yeah, just that smell a bit. Mm, didn't impress me. And the, the, the first mouth hasn't impressed my mouth either. But it's not as bad as I thought it would be, actually. I thought it was just the, I sorry about the haziness yeah. makes me, and all them, Hops and stuff. I thought, it was, be, hops. I thought it was gonna be really yeah. like kind of hoppy, but it's kind of like I think, uh, well, I think it is. It's, actually, it's, it's but... slightly wheaty, you know. It's yeah. kind of slightly wheaty. Quite thick. Mm. Mm. It's not too bad actually. No, it's not as yeah, not as bad as you as I expected it to be. But then again, saying that it's not it's not great either. Mm. But it's not got like a massive flavour, has it? It's got like a kind of little tiny little twang. Yeah, like a sm maybe a small like um, suggestion of fruitiness, probably from the citra or whatever. Yeah, um, and sometimes it's kind of like smooth and creamy because of the all the wheat, that's the wheat and like, stuff yeah. that's in it. Yeah, and the oat flakes or whatever. Yeah, but, um, definitely looks like porridge type, right? Ooh. Yeah, I wonder. Ah. It's just got that horrible look, that kind of sharpness. Yeah. To happy. me, it's like this, the sharpness yeah, of yeah. fruit rather than the sweetness of fruit. Yeah. You know? The Which just seems to be quite happy. It? Yeah, yeah, it is sharpness of the hops, isn't it? Yeah. It's kind of like, makes may, may, may suggest to you fruitiness, but yeah. to me, it always just suggests like, mm, it's kind of like a so, sharp flavour. As soon as you see citron mosaic in any mm. beer, you know where you're heading, mm. basically. Uh, I do tend to be there. I think they're the two most popular ops in modern day beer now. Mm. Definitely. Mosaic and Citra. Do we even get a percentage? Do we even say what percentage it was? Did you find that at all? I didn't actually. No. I don't think I found it. Is it on there? It's got to be illegally. Um, it's so true. Oh, 4.8. Okay. It's quite small. Yeah. Bitterness is it's short of scoring two out of five for bitterness. Hmm. <laughs> I see you in Comet Land. Yeah. Yeah. Funky Fluid is the name of the uh, the late company, but it's really, you see in the little triangle there, Funky Fluid. Oh, funky <laughs> Fluid. Funky <laughs> Fluid. And that's a really kind of like trippy kind of artwork. It's not really coming out very yeah. well here, but it looks like some kind of yeah uh, modern art kind of. Yeah, it looks like. Mm. So that would be a pink Floyd gig in the early, <laughs> early 60s, didn't it? Mm. Very good. Yeah, definitely not a fan of this. Oh, we've got a score them. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, well, that one. <laughs> I know, I yeah. know, but still. Yeah, oh, that one, that one, I'm, I'm going to bring in, push the boat and get that four. Yeah, I might four that. And all. Yeah. yeah, that was like... I mean, maybe oh, you maybe got yeah. the fact that it was the first beer, and yeah. we always we always <laughs> tend to like right, yeah. it's just the fact we've not had a beer for a while. We well, had yeah. a beer yesterday, so it doesn't make sense to you. Yeah. <laughs> Several, but yeah, sometimes when you got the, the hankering for a beer, and you mm. you finally have one, it's like, oh yeah, oh, I mean, that hits the spot. But that really did hit the spot, and it was like, yeah. you know, I was worried it was going to be horrible because I thought the, I'm not massively keen on fruit, like, and I thought the raspberry was going to make it really really sour or super yeah. sickly or something. But no, it went it actually fitted really well as far as this goes though i'd, I'd probably give it like a two and a half something like that i'm gonna go with, i'm gonna go with one yeah yeah one one as much as this is getting because after i drank this i wouldn't go back and get another one if it was the only thing available i wouldn't say oh i'll drink, I'll drink some more it'd be like you know what i'll go and have a cup of tea i think mean. A bit weird, not really much going on with these, but quite one. Well, Similarly, just crackers with a slight olive flavour, yeah, right? yeah, not really much. No, yeah, quite nice, right? Right, let's we get all the stouts together. Or maybe we have a stout next. I think, I think we've got four dark and four pale, you know. Cheers. Yeah, I think so, yeah. Because ah. so I've got this as a black IPA. Ah. Step into a new black IPA. Ooh. And that's weird, look, because we've got a can, but on the book it's showing a bottle. Oh, yes. So that's interesting. Mm. Right, Harbour Brew Company in Bodmin, which is... Uh, uh, is it Dorset? Cornwall. Oh, Cornwall. Cornwall. I thought, oh, okay. Yeah. I know it's down that way. Oh, yeah, <laughs> oh you've been Bodmin Moor. Well, on, on the moor, where the, 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 the Hound of the Baskervilles. Is that yeah. Bodmin Moor, isn't it? Right, 
A generous dry hop of citra and a complex bill of speciality malts combined to give us a hoppy, smooth black IPA, resulting in a soft, silky texture, packed in wheat and rich caramel flavours, finishing with a pleasant but low bitterness. Wow, you poured that like a complete twat, Elric. <laughs> uh, I'm not sure what we're going to score the beer, but I'm going to give Elric a one out of five for that <laughs> pour, I think. It's oh. really frothy. Though. Oh, I think yeah. you're right. Yeah, it's quite lively, isn't it? Yeah. Did you open it too quick or something? Or you can get to, you get so excited. I'll go with, I, I got excited. You get excited. You're like, I, go with, I go with pouring like a twat. <laughs> yeah. Right, so black on the eye. Yeah, it's pretty dark. Vegan oh, vegan friendly. Cool. Caramel and fruity on the nose, it says. And um, uh, speciality malts. But it's got more hoppy than malty. Yeah, that's yeah. that's crazy. Yeah. Oh, because it's an IPA. It's just it's black. Yeah. It's one of those ones that you, you, it's going to, not much in the world. What it looks like isn't going to be what it tastes like. We've had that Absolutely. before. Yeah. So it's got four in hoppy, uh, three in bitter, two in floral, one in fruit and sour, two in mouthfeel, one in sweet, and only two in malty. So it's a lot more hoppy than it is. Well, I'll tell you what, I should change that fucking wheel. I know, that it's wheel annoying. Is shit. <laughs> you can't really see it very well, can yeah, you? 52, the new wheel is shit. Your new wheel. Just put the numbers on like yeah. you did before. Your new wheel is a pile of wank. <laughs> can I, how you can pile wank into a pile, I don't know. Yeah, but, yeah. yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll demonstrate. <laughs> Not on this stream, we'll get no, banned. No, that's true. <laughs> that's true. What was that bad? little snap. A bit dry, isn't they? Yeah, it's just a bit dry, but they're not bad. They're kind of like got a nice decent hair. Yeah, they? not too bad, actually. Is there any <laughs> extras on the can? Oh, my nope, can. we're in wrong one. <laughs> I don't think there was much on here. Five percent mm. aroma caramelized fruit embers. Embers. What that? Uh, Palette roasted malt, tropical, soft finish, citrus and floral. Alan, oh, barley and wheat, vegan friendly. It says here it's caramel and fruit on the nose, but I'm not getting any fruit again. No fruit whatsoever. Nope. Much nose at all, actually, is there? No. We haven't got that. Maybe we haven't got any sensitivity. No, no, I'll just, uh, no. Yeah, no, just going to say we are the no bullshit. Beer, yeah. Beer <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm picking up pomegranate and, <laughs> and uh, body odor and. Oh, that's a story. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> but, Mm. Not sure to make it out. Yeah, yeah, I'm a bit like that. It's quite, it's quite um, viscous again, isn't it? It's quite yeah, a little chewy, bit. Mm -hmm. a bit chewy. But um, still, don't know what to make of it. <laughs> yeah, I know. It, 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 you know what it is because it's a black IPA. Yeah. It's, it's, it's confusing. I'm us. not feeling an IPA kind of feel to it though. And I'm not feeling stout. It's somewhere no. in between, isn't it? Uh, I'm yeah. certainly not getting like four in hoppy like it says it's got. No, I'm not getting any malt though. I'm not getting any malt. No. Um, it's still probably more hoppy, uh, more of an IPA. Yeah, so. you're getting a little bit of that kind of twangy oh. kind of IPA mm. kind of flavour a little bit. But yeah, it's not too bad. Hmm. I suppose it's the best of both both worlds if you're into this sort of thing. Slight little twang at the end, oh. but mainly for me, it's kind of like not much going on. Hmm. I feel there's not much going on with it. But the first mouthful, I was getting some different. I thought I was getting. I don't might have been the remnants of that bloody biscuit in my mouth. <laughs> that bloody well olive Ooh, cracker. Mm, it tastes biscuity. Yeah, crackery. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> a bit like olives. But um, no, it's, it's not. It's one of those ones. It's not unpleasant. Yeah, it's not, it's not unpleasant, but it's not pleasant either. You know. Yeah. Oh, I love. That's what I thought about um, love corn. That's what mm. I figured about these guys. It's cheese and onion, and I, I can't have cheese because it's right. like milk. But it's, it's vegan, though, is it? It's vegan cheese. Right. Yeah, flavouring. Cool. Well, it makes sense. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It makes sense, really. Yeah. I mean, why, why about making a vegan one? And, um, if you can make it vegan, you might as well, aren't you? Because like, everyone can partake them. Yeah. 
And it's not like... Yeah, but as a vegan, I would say that about anything. Yeah. <laughs> can make anything vegan. Yeah, but yeah. other than meat. Yeah, you can still have... Yeah, you can, yeah, you can have, yeah. like... But no, I know what you're saying. Yeah. It's like, when, when... I mean, some, I'm not going to be... Yeah. Eat those and go. Oh, that's not real cheese. Yeah, exactly. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah. You know, it's only cheese flavoring anyway. Exactly. It's, you know, yeah. it's never fucking exact. It's, it's not like so, real cheese. Is no. It? Yeah. Exactly. Mm. Ah. Um. Really not sure where I go on the score for this one. Yeah. It's not. Not doing much for me. Yeah. But then it's not terrible at all. It's not like that nice though, really, is it? No. It's, like, it's not that good. It's still, I still move it more uh, towards an IPA and I do uh, yeah. my dark beer, really. It could do a bit, a bit more malty, a bit more mm. like that, you know, chewy kind of, yeah. you know, mouthfeel kind of, um, mm. it's just kind of a, it's got a little tiny sort of twang, but other than that, it's quite blandish mm. and just, I don't know. I'm still probably going to score it around a two and a half. I was going to go two, two, so that makes sense. Yeah. Because you're normally like half out from, from me you know, on the positive. I was like, I couldn't push it up to a three, but um, if it was what I had on, I'd probably have another beer because it's not, it's not like um, objectionable. Yeah. It's not like, oh, that's enough. You know, it's like, maybe I'll have another, you know. I gotta admit, though, like, I'm, I'm starting my scoring is starting to get a bit lower, like yours now. Mm. Like I tend to go a bit low because I'm, I'm sort of, I'm, I'm starting to get a bit IPA'd out. Mm -hmm. And I, like, I went to our local uh, beer shop, which is the Stone Temple Market. Or, 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 awesome! Like, like uh, I just bought a bunch of really awesome stouts from there. Like, but um, unfortunately, there it was really overload IPA there. Yeah. Like um, more than I've ever seen. I was like, yeah. oh, stop it. Give me something else. It's annoying. Yeah, it but is I don't understand annoying. why IPA. But that's what people like. But I don't understand why IPA is so popular. Yeah, I don't. I don't. It's just a horrible, twangy kind of like. People love it, don't they? Yeah. No. It's weird. Bunch well, of wankers. Yeah. Who <laughs> says the majority are always right? No, they never are. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd be into shitty music, wouldn't we? It's the noisy yeah. minority like us. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. You got that Citra and Mosaic, another IPA. <coughs> yeah, because that was a dark one, that's right. <coughs> Dong oh Feng Brewing. <coughs> Citra User IPA. Mm -hmm. Wait, can you read that bit for us? Yeah, sure. Yeah. <laughs> that's how racist it was. Yeah, no, don't try it. Yeah. Um, I just pointed into the Chinese yeah. characters to try and read it. Mosaic and Citra <laughs> uh, Yuzu IPA, originating from central China. This, oh yeah, lumpy little orange. Yeah. Adds citrusy abundance to a medley of berry aromas imbued by the mosaic, is that a word? Yeah. By the mosaic and citra hops in this IPA. It's the mosaic and citra I'm talking about. Yeah. It says it, mosaic and citra use the IPA. Yeah. From Dung Feng Brewing. That's it, it basically it says exactly on here what right. you just read. So. A, little, a little bit more. Uh, ingredients, water, malted barley, flaked wheat, malted wheat. Malted rye, yuzu hops, yeast. Rye. Yeah, malted rye. Okay. No, I've never, never had malted rye in a beer no, before. No. Rye is like um quite nice. I like eating like uh, rye crackers. Bread. Yeah. yeah. Rye bread and that. Yeah. Uh, um, you don't really get it much. It's more of an American. American yeah. Malted rye. Okay. Yeah. It's four point two percent anyway. Um. So we've got heart. We've got four on fruit. Um, three on mouthfeel, mm. one on sweet, two thing. on malty, mm. three on hoppy, two on bitter, one on floral. Yeah, so not that hoppy, uh, yeah. three hoppy and four on fruit. fruit. Mm. Yeah, we shall see. We That's shall pale see. in color, citrus and berry on the nose, and the hops are citra and mosaic. Okay. Hmm. Smell is kind of like it's not as clean. Yeah, clean. It's actually it's actually it's clean actually a smell. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. it is now. It smells clean. Mm. 
Mm. It's almost got like the first thing I thought when I tasted it was like almost like a grapefruit sort of tasting. There's well, certainly a little bit of fruitiness at the end. Yeah. I've got like a, I was thinking more like a little lemony, yeah. like a gentle lemony. Well, yeah. It could be a grapefruit. Not yeah. Mine a million miles out. And my taste at the end mm. was very grapefruit. It's quite it's like fresh. And it's not overbearing. The hops, you said the hops are only three, and it definitely hasn't got a massive twang to it. It's got kind of like, it a slightly fruity, yeah. like um, an assuming Fruit kind of uh, flavour to it. They did talk about orange lumps, didn't they? Mm. <laughs> Lumpy little orange, whatever that means. What does that mean to mean? I don't Was know. that like a bad translation or something? Yeah, I don't know. I what like it? it though, Lumpy Orange. Oh, it says at the top here, did you notice that? Inspired by the Red Dragon. Mm. It says at the top, wow. inspired by the Red Dragon. Who the hell is the Red Dragon? A real Red Dragon? <sighs> or from mythology? We try, you try to talk real, right? So yeah. yeah mythology. <laughs> I said mythology. <laughs> is it? Is it? Uh, you don't. Why you said it? <laughs> yeah. Is it mythology? <laughs> I didn't say is it mythology. Did I? I said from mythology. I don't uh, really know. Shall I? Uh, shall I drink your beer? <laughs> I think dragons are real anyway. Mm. Yeah, definitely an orangey grapefruit sort of mm. thing is, um, and it's not severely high on the hoppy thing no it's all right but it's very light very light fruity mm. it, it does like uh like we've uh, said before it tastes more doesn't really taste like a beer it tastes no. like, uh, almost like but, a yeah, orange juice yeah like a very light mm. yeah it tastes it's really, it tastes like to me quite fresh though. it tastes like water yeah. and it took stuck a very very small amount of juice of like um mm. concentrate of like you know squash in it squash yeah, concentrate yeah. and a know? little bit of alcohol yeah, yeah. I kind of imagine it could be nice on a hot day. Spritzers, is it called spritzers? Yeah. The new alcoholic water thing that, that's right. quite uh, popular. Okay. No, not spritzer. Seltzer. 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 Oh, right. Seltzer's a reference. Yeah. Yeah. Is it Seltzer? The name's Seltzer. Is it different? Is it a new, yeah, new, new take on the old word? It's a new word. take on, um, right. mm. on alcoholic water. Like, um, what are they called um, that we used to get in... Say hi to no, Hidden it's... Gem. Oh, hi, Hidden, Hidden yeah. Gem is quite young, so he can't drink. Don't drink beer until you're 21 in America. Oh, yeah. You're not allowed. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> it's not that funny. It is. It's... The only country in the world that has yeah. the, you can't drink until you're 21. Moosehead uh, lager. We're not really lager. Well, you, like, you don't mind I lager. Don't lager yeah. Have, you had lager? Have you had moosehead? I may have done. It's Canadian, you, I guess. You, you kind of look like you've got a moose head. Yeah. If you, you, you look at you from a certain angle, you say you look like you've got a moose head. <laughs> um, yeah. I can't remember what I was talking about. No, neither can I. Um, um, was it important? <laughs> let us know in the comments what yeah. I was talking about. If anyone about. knows what Elwood was talking about, please let us know. Yeah. <laughs> mm. But this is not too bad. Hmm. It's not too, no, it's not bad at all. But I remember seltzer. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's it's like um, remember you used to get the Algo pops. Yeah. It's like a more sort of um, it's like like a Less crafty fruit. ale version of one of, the, of that okay. sort of drink. So it's like alcoholic fruit juice. Okay, really. fair enough. But they yeah. they've made pushed it up. They basically they basically pushed it up and they're selling it for three times the price they used to. Is that what they've yeah, done? Basically. Yeah, basically. <laughs> you had one in one of your beer things didn't you? you had little ones remember like it was a little uh can oh yeah. the mixer it was a mixer though for june yeah. wasn't it yeah oh was it oh, yeah right. it was a mixer yeah was that a seltzer i think it, I think it was a, i think it was a mixer yeah. and i had it with a little gin of uh mother's day or something i can't remember now mm. oh you're drinking quicker now you mm. mind that one. no i think i go um uh, Nothing unpleasant. Squ yeah. But would I want to drink that many of them? Not really. On a hot day. It tastes like beer. On a hot day, yeah. On a hot day, I reckon I can do work. three of these. Yeah. Three or four, even if you start, you know, start getting the flavour for it. Is it particularly strong? Because the the, the, the um. Four point nine. Four point nine. That's not yeah. too bad. Because it hasn't got like that horrible twang that some of them. Yeah. Got. There was there was no nasty twang to that at all. Just a little sort of very very gentle like. Blinking your miss it fruitiness to it. Mm. So, but yeah, I mean, I'm, again, it's like. I probably just got a three. Yeah. Two and a half, three. 
Yeah, and I'm thinking to myself, I don't think I'll go that high. Mm. It's just like, I mean, in a certain situations, I can see myself drinking this one more than in the other light one. You see what I mean? But I won't go so far as to say that I'd, in like a, an average day, if there's other, other darker beers on there, I'll, I'll go and pick them instead, you know? Yeah. But that wasn't unpleasant. I'm going to go two. Yeah. I'll say two, and that's quite a high score for me for for the, a pale. The funny thing <laughs> with me, if I'm if I'm hot and I want mm. a sort of refreshing beer, I I do actually usually go lager, right? Yeah, or, or, or a cider or something. Yeah, I, I don't tend to do that. Right. It's just shit you haven't messed up the uh, the, the dark beers. The... How are we at so far? Four. Mm. So we've got two dark beers left. This is a dark beer. I think this is a dark beer. So we should be on. Ah, oh, no, we don't have more order, you know that. Uh, we have to finish on a dark beer, don't we? Yeah, we always got to finish on a dark beer. So we've done them all the way around then. So we're on the light beer now. No dark beer, don't like being a dark yeah, beer. Yeah, that's so, cool. Yeah. Cool. Okay. Right. Yeah. It's, uh, you'd think it wouldn't be like a, a, a thing to have to work out. To, uh, <laughs> just two guys sitting down drinking beer, but it's like we're sitting there like planning out our. Planning everything. Yeah. <laughs> We don't just throw these so streams right. together, you know. They're, yeah. they're carefully evaluated. Yeah. Well, let me read this one first, rather than you read the can, because your can might end up being competing. Okay. So you know not to, because quite often yeah. you read the can first, and it's like, oh, it's all here on the book. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Right. <laughs> Elevation by Wicklow Wolf from County Wicklow, I guess, in, in Ireland. Uh, pale Ale, 4.8%. An incredibly drinkable brew, bursting with juicy fruits of pineapple and grapefruit, from an abundance of hop additions. An independent ale with a refreshing finish made for independent minds. Oh. Right, it's a hazy pale, fruity on the nose. The hops are mosaic, strata, calypso, and huel melon. Not, not it's got four in bitter, yeah. okay. three in hoppy and malty, three in mouthfeel, uh, three in floral, one in sweet, one in fruit, and zero in sour. Why has it only got one in fruit? Because it's not a fruity one. No, it's just bursting with juicy fruits of uh, pineapple uh, and grapefruit. They are, uh, yeah. How can you say that and then only have one, one in the in fruit? fruit? Yeah. Well, maybe they say that and then the experts really don't know. No, you're talking shit, mate. We're giving you one for fruit. Yeah, we should, we should be on the panel. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Uh, yeah, I prefer to be on the drinking. Brew, it's the same, isn't it? Yeah, mm. yeah. I prefer to be on the drinking, grapefruit. drinking and not thinking panel. That's the panel yeah. I like. Yeah. Lots of drinking, not too much thinking. Okay, I got a little beer um, at Wicklow Wolf. Our mission is to brew exceptional beer without compromise and with true passion. Independently brewed for independent minds. Yeah. All right. We are locally rooted and. At one with nature, brew hmm. beers in a, <laughs> in a one with nature. They walk around the brewery naked. Yeah, I was like, <laughs> you were gonna say that, really like. yeah, I knew you were gonna say something like that. <laughs> um, cool can. I like the yeah, that. I like the wolf. It's cool. And you probably can't see this on the thing, but you've got like an outer kind of like this outer label, and you got the silver, just the plain oh, silver yeah, can yeah, inside. Yeah, yeah. So it yes. kind of, yeah, design, it's, yeah, yeah, it's quite an interesting design. And it's quite a nice wolf on there if you like wolves. Oh, you know what it is? It's like the, it's the mountains, isn't it? Mm. Oh yeah, maybe yeah, 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 yeah. It's the mountains. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's cool. So that's like the sky. Mm. Nice idea. Right. Fancy. Uh, very slightly fruity on the nose. <laughs> very very slightly. Where they based? Uh, Wicklow, which is an island, isn't it? Oh, okay. County Wicklow, isn't it? Right. It's weird though, because to me it is quite fruity. Yeah, I thought that as well. Yeah. I was actually just thinking now, it's got like a fresh, fruity kind of feel. When you, we're always suspicious about this. <laughs> yeah. It's always a bit weird to us. Yeah, it's got mm. nice, like kind of like a slightly crisp. Yeah, kind of like feel in the mouth, hasn't it? Pineapples and grapefruit. Well, I guess you know. I suppose the sourness is always great. Grapefruit. Yeah. Um, but it hasn't got that though, has it? it hasn't got any kind of hoppiness or. Not has it got four bitter? Mm. Fuck off! <laughs> Fuck off! That's not four bitter, is it? Not that. It's not. It's not bitter, bitter at all. No, not really. I wouldn't say. 
I don't know. We don't fucking understand. We don't know. I don't, either they don't know what we're talking about or we don't know what we're talking about. And um, go with us, probably. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> probably. We don't write beer books. Do no, we? exactly. Yeah. We don't taste beer to me. Yeah. No, not really. Uh, uh, obviously, it's there because um, most beer has got that bittery sort of yeah. taste, but it's not. It's not brutal. No, it's not. I'm barely getting any bit at all. Personally, mm. it's like it's not. It's mal- a very it's slight not malty either. It's like free mm. and malty. It's like mm. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. no, I don't floral. Know. I go with floral, and the fruit should be higher. Yeah, I'm not sure. sure. What I don't know. Yeah. I suppose it's like it's not like smack you in the face fruity it's just like it's got like um a fruity kind of sense to it kind of thing yeah like um a fruity sense yeah um i'm certainly so not getting the bit i can't i definitely don't agree with the bitter mm. yeah moose head lagers uh, is um in Foga gray from america you know? i can't remember he used to make um mods on fallout because it like Moosehead Lager just reminds me of something from Canada. Yeah, you think it was from Canada. Yeah, Moose, yeah. There is actually a place called Moosehead in Canada, isn't there? Right. Okay. I'm sure there's a place called yeah. Moosehead in Canada. It's not. I've definitely heard of it, but it's not something I've, I've seen over here. I don't mm. think I've tried, but mm. yeah. I don't think I've seen it over here either. I can't think of any Canadian, Canadian Lager. Michelob is that Canadian? Oh, what's Michelob? It might be. Um, we don't get it over here, though, do we? Yeah, we get Nicolob. Not often, often but, no, no. Yeah, I've had it. Mm. I'm trying. Yeah, let us know what the uh, uh, premium sort of Canadian beer is. I've no intention of drinking any, but you can let us know still. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I bet. I bet there's something you've heard of, but Nicolob does ring a bell. Yeah, I've heard of Nicolob. being Canadian. Yeah. Sounds German, doesn't it? Maybe it's German yeah, okay. origin. Um, I'm surprised we've got some German origin oh. to it. Oh, sorry. Sure. I'll go um, straight down the middle with three again, I think. Yeah? Yeah. Um, I'll go. I'm going to go with two. Yeah. Nothing objectionable about it. Yeah. Not super fruity. Again, another one that might be nice on a hot day, you know? Fruity and one, though. Yeah, I'd definitely say fruity and yeah. one. Oh, I don't know. Oh, down to Frisnes. Hey! Oh, was it Moose Jaw? Yeah, it could be right. Mm. Moose Jaw's in Canada. Mm. Yeah. Welcome to the Beer and Geography Show. Yeah. <laughs> Let us know where Canadian I know beer. I've heard of something to do with a yeah. moose in Canada. Oh, yeah. Plenty of them. There's a place called London in Canada as well. Yeah. What do you call it? The fake London. Fake London. Fake London. Right. Do you want to finish on? Well, we've got we've got three more to go. Yeah. So the, what? Which one do you want to save as the last um, dark one? Oh, the I cake don't know. one. Who knows? Um, no, no, because that might not be good for me. So, uh, so I, I, let's let's not do that one last. The one that might I might not be vegan, basically. All right. It might be. <laughs> all right, though. So, look. I can't see anything on it. It would. It comes up. Well, mind you, it might not be. No, actually, they're not. Either. They're not showing them at the moment, are yeah. they? Well, oh, no, I'm saying not suitable for vegans, aren't yeah, it? They they have have a little lactose. Thing, what what is it? It's a cake one, isn't it? Yeah. City of cake yeah. contains lactose. Yeah. There you go. I was sensible there. Nah, that was what I was mine. doing. Hamilton. Oh, Hamilton. Hamilton Brewing <laughs> Company. <laughs> Oh, no, it's Hamilton. It was in London. It's in London. Oh, fair enough. Hamilton. No, it's Hamilton. Where the fuck? Oh. Oh, okay. Probably in Hamilton. Yeah. How much is it in Hamilton? I might as well point myself, man. I don't know if I'm going to be getting my own. No, no, you read. Right. Um, chocolate fudge cake stout. I should bring it all. As oh. as you're drinking. Oh, right. Yeah, I'll do it all for you. I <laughs> know, <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, you can point it out. <laughs> He's confusing the hell out of me now. But I'm also doing everything. Well, yeah. Yeah, oh, we've got another one. Got... Hello, Kenneth F. Strand. He's from one of the bands I've interviewed. I'm sure he is. Ha ha! First oh, time seeing it. Oh, yes, the guy from um, yeah. Evalon. Yeah. First time seeing this part of your happenings. How many beers do you usually drink during these? Well, it's normally eight on a normal month, but every yeah. three months, oh, he gets a 12 can box. And uh, yeah, those get messy. Those messy get but happy. Messy, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it can be from evil on. Yeah. Good stuff. 
Wow. Down I'll, to Frisnes. I'll pour like an Elric. Yay. Down to Frisnes is Liam's mate. One of Liam's old school friends. Oh, okay. Cool. Yeah. Probably met him. Um, I think we have. Might, yeah. I don't know. I don't think so. But right, a city of cake. A uh, <laughs> city of room. cake. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, I've heard that name said about five times already while we've done this. And for some reason, when you just said it, then it made me laugh. <laughs> city of cake. Must be the beer. City of cake. Hamilton Brew Company. Yeah. <laughs> Um, yeah, style chocolate fudge cake stout, mm. 5.5, enjoy it 10 degrees. <gasps> Put it back. Uh, tasting notes. Um, oh, literally, I've just tasted a tiny little bit of the, of the foam, and I can I can taste the chocolatey cake, and it's just mm. in the foam. I, I'll tell you what they, they um, have started doing with the wheel as well, I noticed, is they don't have any other info now. It, it used to be info on the brewery and mm. tasting notes, mm. now it's just tasting notes. So you have to read the can now. But that's all right. It gets us both talking, I guess. Mm. Um, yeah. Uh, Taste notes. A deep and rich chocolate milk stout, balancing roasted coffee, chocolate notes, and sweetness, mm. followed with fudge and caramel aroma. Is it nice? I bet it's nice. <laughs> sweet is five. Well, it is quite sweet. Yeah. Yeah. I was just thinking that. Mouthfeel and malty are both mm. four. Bitter is three. I think there's just a little bit too much uh, sweetness for yeah. it to fill the bitterness. Fruit and hoppy is one. But I got the chocolate straight from a, just from a little bit of the foam. I felt the chocolate, but yeah, it's got a very like kind of like sweet. Maybe that's the sweetness of the fudge, like sour through. is half. <laughs> Look, half. Is it half? Yeah, it's a half. It's weird because they do do uh, a few halves. Oh, I can smell that. Oh, that's a smell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's good. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> I'm missing out. <laughs> nice. The nose is sweet fudge. It's roasted malt and it's black. Mm. Wow. The sweetness is like kind of like a. It's quite. It's kind of a little. You know, it's like so sweet. Your eye kind of like scrunched up a little bit. Like you know, call <laughs> your eye like. Oh. The that, yeah, sometimes. Yeah. Yeah. But the sweetness is amazing as well. But yeah, no, it's not bad. It does be a little bit more malty, I think. Yeah. It's like the kind of, it's a little bit, maybe. Mega sweet. Yeah, maybe a little bit too much on the sweet side. I suppose it is called cake. It is called cake, yeah, yeah. but it's, it's definitely. Mm. Mm. It's a shame it just says London. You like know mm. exactly where it is. One of it's certainly there. Oh, and you're still all right, of course you are. Yeah, I've got finished, yeah. Because all in there. actually say where, where they brew from. No, Hamilton Brewery, a deep and rich chocolate milk stout, balancing roasted coffee. Coffee? Mm. Am I getting any coffee? A chocolate nose to the sweetness, followed with a fudge and caramel's aroma. Mm. <sighs> oh, Islington. Oh. Roman Way in Islington. It, it is. It is mm. Homer, Homer and Hammer and then. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> pretty much that's not far I mean. off. Yeah. Uh, Roman wow. Way. That's, that's round the corner to us, virtually. It's only a few miles away. Yeah, Roman Way is one of those big yeah. roads. Like, I know, I've always known it's been there, but I've probably only been there once in my life, I think. <laughs> I think me and my dad went there on a pub crawl one time. Yeah. And my dad was recreating a pub crawl from like yesteryear. And, oh, you man. know, they, don't, they used to go on like, there as a uh, young Like that film. Um, fucking uh, The Well. The end of the world. Mm, mm, mm. <laughs> it all goes wrong. No, you call the world's end, isn't it? Oh, is it the world's end? Yeah, I think it's the yeah. last pub, isn't it? The world's end that you can yeah. go going towards. Yeah. As well as part of it, yeah. <laughs> wow. Where's that a picture of? <laughs> Gotta get my glasses up. That was a cake in the city. <laughs> it's a cake in the city. <laughs> as you do. As you do. Um, oh, that's cool. Yeah, Roman Way. Yeah, it's got. Mm. I, I think they still have stores and stuff like that. Awesome, yeah. Still, still do that. I think you're not missing that too badly because it's one of those ones, like you say, because of the sweetness, okay. it's like you don't want to have too many of them, I don't think. Yeah. It's like gentlemen, English <laughs> gentlemen cakes walking down the streets, <laughs> mm. and all the buildings are cakes. 
<laughs> I love some of y'all. <laughs> I went to grab that, thinking I left. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, dude. Yeah. Yeah. There was like a little bit of coolness which I took to be like the, the milk, you know, yeah. whatever sort of milk is in there. Gives it like a sort of coolness to the mouthfeel. But then now I'm just literally like a little bit of coffee in the first bit of foam that I taste out. Not coffee, but chocolate. Um, maybe there's a little bit of coffee in there, but mainly it's just that fudgy yeah. sweetness. Yeah. Like, you know, Quite drag, heavy, dragging heavy. its heels. Yeah. yeah. Heavy, it's yeah. like it's almost it's like it's too sweet to um, yeah. to want to partake of that much, yeah. you know? You could do with probably like, be sick if you had. You could do with a bit more coffee or a little bit more maltiness yeah. to, to take off the edge of that sweetness. Mm. Do you know Christmas you bought that blending kit of different whiskies? Yeah. And you have the different whiskey, the different flavour notes nice. or whatever. Like Sometimes it. I think it'd be quite nice to do with some of the beers. Yeah. But you could take this one. Mix it up with some of the ones that got too much coffee flavour in them. Yeah. And the sweetness would like balance out the, the, yeah. the super too too much coffee flavour. Can you do that with beers? I don't that? know if you can. You probably really can't. Know. It would ruin you just everything, would. Yeah, probably. Uh, <laughs> hmm. Yeah. I want to go back to them um, um, Chivas Regal uh, uh, blending like class thing that they do like it's well, not really a class uh, like because it's going to get pissed yeah, yeah <laughs> they call it a class so they can get away with doing it <laughs> it's brilliant but like, it's such a bargain. come and get pissed with us <laughs> yeah uh, they, they tell you about it and then you just go blending your own whiskies and, and you take your own whiskey out and you drink as much as you like and it's it's really um not expensive to do either like yeah i loved it and i wanted to do a second one and then guess what happened oh it was very cool let me guess was it the beginning of a scene ending the Ovid? Yeah. <laughs> mm. So I hope they're um, going to get them back up and running again. They're brilliant. <laughs> Whew. Mm. Do you want me to rinse that out? Is it a bit stouty or, or are you happy? No, I don't know. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. Tricky one. Yeah. Tricky to score. Mm. I'm going to have to go low. Serious? Mm, yeah, yeah low is because uh, it was just like that sweetness was like still there, you know? Yeah. It's one of those ones that just like, oh, mm. it's not quite, it's like the, it's the old squinty eyes again yeah. but from sweetness rather than from hoppiness, you know? Yeah. It's not terrible. It, eh? it's, not, it's not terrible, yeah. but it's one of those where yeah. like, I think if I was buying that, I'd be like, Maybe two, maybe yeah. two, like two pints, and I'll be like, oh my god, my fucking mouth, I feel so, I need to go and brush my teeth. Yeah. You know what I mean? I'm going to yeah. brush my teeth now. I feel like I've like, I've like, desecrated your mouth. I feel like I've mugged a couple of kids on Halloween night and stolen yeah. all their sweets and everything. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean? So, what, so you oh. score out of two, yeah? Yeah, I think I'm yeah, yeah. two. Yeah. It's just like the over, the overarching like feel of it is just sweetness. Yeah. You know? Um, there's a little oh, that's got us on there. Yeah, isn't it? Well, I'll send it to them yeah. before they can't read it. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Two chefs brewing. That was good. Do you have that on your thing? Hazy IPA. Let's have a look. I don't think I did see him, mate. So maybe I was Coffee mistaken shop. when I said there wasn't much in there. There's a. Uh, maybe I was looking on the wrong page. Uh, Speed skating. Oh, these skating. two are on a 10 pad. That explains why they're not on there. There's a windmill. Is it Dutch by any chance? Yeah, and these yeah. two are on the 12 got, pack. That's why they're not on yeah, there. Yeah, so Dutch maybe was... bike. Yeah, you got clogs, hops, windmills, and speed Oh, no, these are on the light pack. Look, these are on the light pack. That's why we haven't got them. Yeah, it's not on there, no? Yeah, there is. Yeah, there we Ooh. go. They are, they're just not, I think maybe they were. More than we thought, actually. Yeah. yeah. Right, oh, my mouth, <laughs> like, my mouth doesn't want to speak yeah, anymore, it's like it's drunk. Good. Right, it's Amsterdam. 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 Welcome to this Amsterdam beer. Two chefs brewing. <laughs> what the fucking hell was that? Wow. Did, that's that's it, minus it, one out of five of pouring yeah, skills. It did explode at me, this one. Actually. Oh. <laughs> so she, that's what she said. She, she said. <laughs> Stop. 
and smell the tulips with this hazy IPA from the land below Stop. sea level, where windmills and bicycles prevail. I know that's not Dutch to it. And coffee shops offer more than just coffee. <laughs> Heaps of hops give this mighty, juicy uh -huh. brew, punchy aromas, and subtle hints of mango, pine, and a tinge of tangy citrus. If anyone can identify that accent, please let me know. Uh, I think that accent's gone off the rails and yeah. needs to be rescued. It's just got to talk like that with a slight lisp. That's <laughs> right. Hazy and pale on the eye, yeah, fruity on the one. nose, and the hops are Chinook, ah. Citra, Mosaic, and Nelson Savon. I'm not that one, Nelson no. Savon. Uh, it's Chinook. I'm sure Chinook, Chinook is a type of fucking he helicopter, isn't it? Maybe. Is Chinook not a type of helicopter? I don't know. I don't know, but I know it's a type of hop. Mm. Right. Oh, we got hoppy. <clears throat> oh, I see. Wheel. I'm still pouring. I'm yeah, still the wheel is five on hoppy. Yeah. Four on mouthful. I can't speak. Four oh. on mouthfeel. <laughs> mouthfeel. <laughs> four on fruit. Four on floral. Three on bitter. Uh, one on malty. Two on sweet. Zero on sour. Okay, then. I'm gonna have some of these cool bits because cool before you bits. steal them all. Okay, yeah. <laughs> Stop and smell it. Yeah, you're yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, to citrus. Okay, so I got a bit more. Two chefs brewing. Brew, brew, brews. <laughs> brew, brews. The way sh chef, chef food. Oh, I no. see. Yeah, two chefs brewing. Brews, brew. Yeah. I think the way chef, chef food. What? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. And they're, they're one. Because uh, <laughs> I, I, I for, for real, we believe brewing is, yeah, is culinary art. So we create each culinary. culinary, like an artwork. It's mm. creative expression you can taste, like true chefs and uh, were passionate about our craft and are constantly uh, hunting for new and exciting flavors, all work and no play. Oh well, oh hell, no. We also love oh. crack, crack, cracking beers. I love with... crack. <laughs> I need more powerful glasses. Yeah. Cracking beers with friends and, and blasting banging tunes. Okay. Our mission, brew super tasty beer to tickle your taste buds and complement your lifestyle. Drink beer, drink it fresh, drink two chefs. Cheers. Yeah, it's like fruitiness. Ingredient. Can you even see that ingredient? Even no glasses way. Are struggling with that. Well, the first is in it's his ingredients, and so it's like in a different yeah. language. It's like Netherlands is in Dutch. Yeah. Um, yeah, but not well. No, it's hurting my eyes to try and look at it. There's GB is uh, ingredients: water, barley, oats. Uh, spelt is that? Spelt maybe. Spelt. Yeah. That's a that's a Smee. Yeah. I don't know if I can know what that's it. This is going hops, yeast, yeah. and it contains gluten. What the fuck is that? What? Spelt. Oh, it looks like spelt. Spelt, yeah, spelt. Spelt? What the fuck is spelt? Have you not heard of that? Spelt, yeah, it's just, it's, it's foreign. <laughs> Water, barley, oats, spelt, hops, yeast, yeah. Contains gluten. <laughs> and you don't like it. <laughs> oh, that's weird. Right. It's like. Mm. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Kicks your ass a bit, doesn't it? Mm. How strong is it? Oh, DDH, I forgot. Dub ah, double. Double dry hops. Ah, that's yeah. what the DDH is. That's, that's why these are quite. Strong. These are the most stressful of beers mm. on the DDHs. Mm. Because they um, double dry hop means they throw in the hops. It's like, oh. During the process. We've got enough hops already. Let's yeah. throw some throw fucking more, more hops in. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. It starts off like a slightly orangey kind of like feel to me. And then it's only like a. Bleh! It's like it starts off like innocently, like a tiny little orange fruitness. And then suddenly something fucking goes off in your mouth and it's like. Bleh! What the fuck is that weird fucking? I quite like the um, twang. I quite like the sort of um, taste of it though. Ooh. If you take out the, um, it's got an almost slightly caramelly sort of taste. If you take out the blatant brutal hoppiness, it's, the actual taste isn't too bad. Looking caramel. Mm. 
That's not really, but yeah. I don't know. Again, like a, to me, it's like a like an orangey, like like Mandarin, like very slightly. Yeah, yeah. But then there's something like it, it feels good, like it's like okay, slightly fruity. But then suddenly there's like a oh, there's more down here. There's like a twist at the end. And suddenly there's some some kind of hot fucking hot. thing kicks off, and it makes your mouth go. Ooh. Are you being hot raped? Not quite. It's like no, it's like, not, but it's weird. It's a weird hot rape. It is a hot rape, but it's not quite. Yeah. It's not like just like. It's like it's, like it's almost like you can't feel nothing. It feels fine, and suddenly you get like a little twist, like like someone twists a knife on the side. You're like, in your throat, right? Yeah, but it's like more in my mouth than in my throat. I'm getting yeah. the, the hoppiness. It's like literally I've drunk a beer. It's like that's nice, and suddenly something sharp goes off. It's like. Ooh. It says down here actually. This is bit. We added a chinook and citra in the whirlpool. And double dry hops with citra, mosaic, and yeah. Nelson Salvin. Oh. So obviously they're thrown, just thrown more in. I've just done the bubbliest burp ever. Was that? So, that, burp, that burp had a head on it, I swear. <laughs> mm. oh. It's quite strong tasting, actually. I yeah. think I'm, you know what? I think I'm getting used to the hop. Uh, well, yeah. the first time it, the mouth feels like, I don't, I don't hate it. And then after it was like, yeah. Yeah. and then it was like, yeah. and now you're like, and I was like, okay, I got it. Yeah. I got it. And now I understand. <laughs> it's like I'm taming it. Yeah. It's like my mouth is taming the hot feel. That's unusual um, for you <laughs> and me in a way because usually we like the beer to start with and then it gets a bit stressful. Yeah. Like it's going the other way. That you. is, yeah, definitely. Yeah. But I've got to say, it was a very weird the way it's, yeah. it was. Because literally, it felt the like same things happening to me. Yeah, yeah. it felt like it felt like okay, this isn't like, this is all right. Bit yeah. ONG, and so it was like, whoa, yeah. like that. It came out of nowhere, yeah. and so he whacked you over the head. Yeah, you know. Now, now we've got used to. Yeah, it. Yeah, now I've got used to that kind of, kind of sudden twist of like hoppiness. Oh, that's yeah. fucking weird. Even if we're both drunk and having a joint hallucination or something, I don't know. Yeah, this yeah. is a very weird beer. Cheers, Joseph. Mmm. Thanks for coming on, mate. So that last mouthful, I never got any fucking like yeah. hot attack afterwards. Wouldn't mean, I mean, cool, blimey, this is kind of, I feel like I've run a marathon after this yeah. one. <laughs> and literally, I, it's so weird. It's like, that is, it stands alone as, uh, un, as the strangest one that I've had for ages. Yeah. Because of the fact, literally, that you felt nothing. You thought, oh, this is fine. A little bit orangey. <laughs> Like that, and the next mouth, it was like the same, but the ooh was dialed down a little bit. But it actually felt differently. That one, I don't fucking know. Yeah. It's all in your imagination when you're trying to like analyze a flavor. It's still not know, something I'd, I'd uh, buy. No. Uh, I'm still scoring at two and a half. Oh, god, you have two and a half. That's as that. Yeah, yeah. I, I was think I was thinking originally three because I was getting used to it, and then I was thinking two. Mm. I feel yeah, like it was two, 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 two and a half for me. I feel like we could keep on drinking it just in case, see if it gets better and better and yeah. better and better. The more, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's like, would you like enjoyed each mouthful subsequently better? Like, is there a cut off to how much better? Yeah, but you know what? The funny thing is, is, first third, I was like, ah, yeah. like you. Yeah. Second third, I was like, it's not bad. Third third, I was like, I'm sorry, not like it again. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> Come in thirds. Mm. Fuck. How many fucking cool nuts you dropped on the floor, you bloody cack handy twerp? Uh, <laughs> yeah, my foot cool nuts. Were you, were you crucified at some point? Are you holes in, the, in your hands or something? What's going on? <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. They're quite they're nice, aren't they? Hmm. Oh. I've got some free cool nuts. They sent me some for free. Oh, yeah, I'm all right. Woohoo! Always finish with that one. If no one's uh, watching, we always finish it's with that. It's the final beer. Doc has hooked the hook. Oh, yeah. 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 That's a match. Sounds like it should be Cockney Rhymes then. Yeah. We've got Butcher's Hook, haven't we? Yeah, Butcher's Hook. Guatemala. What? Robust coffee porter, 6%. I love this. Ken's mad, isn't it? Mmm. 
what's the matter? In hops, we believe. Right. It says Guatemala. Wow, 6%. But it's Bell Grape. Oh, okay. Bell Grape. Maybe, maybe the coffee comes from Guatemala or something. Oh, yeah, maybe. Yeah, have a read. Yeah, Guatemala beans. Oh, there you go. So what's Bell Grape? Bell Grape is. Uh, it's one of the Eastern. Yeah, Bell Grape is. Oh. Oh, it's one of the uh, former Slovakia or Slovenia or something like that. One of the former Yugoslavia places, isn't it, Belgrade? Uh, mm. So I couldn't tell you what country, to be honest. Um, I feel like I'm just know, but. Yeah. Mm, fair enough. Dogma Brewery, 6% coffee porter. A robust porter originating from industrial docks. The team used artisanal coffee from a local roastery and have boosted the aroma and flavour with Guatemalan beans. Dark brown in the eye, yeah. coffee on the nose. No mention of the malts. That's strange. Every other one mentions the, no the malts or the, or the hops. This one has no mention of it. Can't be Belgrade's Croatia, but it's definitely one of the former bloody yeah. Like country, but Anyone in chat know where Belgrade is? I'm gonna have to look it up. Oh, for fuck's sake! Can you just throw beer away. On me. Nice one. Nice one, Elric. Thank you. <laughs> Belgrade. Oh, I haven't got a D on my bloody well. Um, Belgrade. Serbia. Okay, yeah. Oh, that's right, it's one of them. Did I, not say, did I say Serbia in one of my many guesses? No. I, think, I think it's a Slovenia, then now I can't remember now. Yeah. Well, I knew it was former Yugoslavia. But... I, knew, I, knew it was, I knew it wasn't I knew it was London. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I knew it wasn't round here. Yeah, I knew it was somewhere foreign. Yeah. <laughs> well, last beer. Oh, yeah, let's chin it up. Cheers to the beers. Chin chin on bean. Yeah. Clear some of these um, corn cool nuts out of the mouth. Yeah. What's the smell? Have we got any more Dogma Brewery? 6%. You know what? I, I, I might have had a cold, but I don't think my my fucking nose is good for fucking smelling beer because like, I can't even smell coffee on this. Can you smell coffee? No, I can't smell much. There's not much smell at all. No. Unfiltered, unpasteurized, I don't know if you said this or right. unpasteurized beer, ingredients, water, barley, malt, coffee, hops, yeast. Yeah. Uh, Store in a dry, dark, and cool place. Okay. We have our body. Yeah. <laughs> Going in. Dogby Brewery, Red Necker, Free, Belgrade, Serbia. It says it here. Mm. Um, but it's imported to Beer 52 Limited. So yeah, it's another sort of Beer 52 beer speciality. Hmm. Mm. Oh, at first you think, oh, there's no flavour, and then it, and then yeah. it kicks in, doesn't it? It's a late, it's a late flavour, isn't it? Mm. I was mulling it around in my mouth a little bit, oh. seeing if I could pick up some stuff. And there's a, oh, maybe it's... a tiny bit of coffee, but it's like nah, it's, it's, it's afterwards the, the coffee, coffee kicks in. Yeah, it's big at the, the coffee. end. The coffee, yeah. you get that kind of oh, like a little bit of a blast, like of coffee. They're yeah, not wrong with um, the front cover of mm. people carrying coffee bags. <laughs> you know. but it's not, yeah. it's not too heavy though. Mm. Well, man, I reckon we get used to that coffee after burn. Yeah. No, after a few hours. Nice. It's nice. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Not like chewy. No, but coffee. Like definitely, coffee. definitely coffee. Definitely coffee. Definitely coffee. Mm. It's not that. Um, you know, sometimes when the coffee ones, it, to, to me, tastes like the coffee that's been in the pot for like three days or so. It's like a really coffee. strong, yeah. like, I like gravelly. Yeah, but yeah. like you know, beer. I'm not too sure. Yeah. Sometimes yeah. it's like it's too, be a bit much. It's that like coffee rate. Yeah. yeah, it's like. But this is um. But it tastes quite like that. It's yeah. not that really, really heavy, yeah. oppressive coffee. It's still probably <clears throat> maybe Ooh, slightly too much to be mm. like a really nice. But I'm thinking maybe it will, yeah. it will get you'll get used to it as you go along. That's what I'm thinking. 
I say. Uh, so that mouthful, mm. I didn't get the big tail end kind of coffee afterburn that I've got with um, the first lot. Mm. But yeah. Yeah, yeah, I've sort of got used to it now. I've already placed this in my mind where it's mm. going to go in, in my mm. final listing. Because mm. I'm thinking to myself, Me too, how does way. it compare to so and so? How does yeah. it compare to so and so? Yeah. Mm. They've been um, relatively strong beers, haven't they? They've all been around five and six percent. Mm. So, yeah. Just as a 12 beer one, I think it would be quite fun. <laughs> quite possibly, yeah. I'm not feeling that drunk, to be honest, but no. sort of slightly buzzy, but not. I'm, I feel like I'm, I'm going to go and play your Fallout in a minute. If anyone wants to, if anyone here in the Fallout, like what's Play him, drunken Fallout. You'll have a chance. You'll have a chance to beat him. No, you, you can't play against each other, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, well, you could probably hit, watch me messing up badly. Yeah. <laughs> it might be fun. Hmm. Yeah, watch him get killed and fall off cliffs and stuff <laughs> from mm. high buildings. I probably what will happen. I'll get overconfident, oh. like I'll be charging into battles where I should be sneaking in like I normally do. You know? Yeah. It's like ah, oh, sod it. I've had a few beers. <laughs> <Charge>. <laughs> oh, I'm dead. Hey, right. true flat. I'm going to be on playing true flat. Just said eight beers and a well between us. I thought you said true flat. Yeah, no, true flat is his true name. Flat. Yeah, I'm going to play some Fallout after this with uh, a Fallout dr drunken yeah. Fallout. Yeah, he's a fall he's a Fallout fella. Same fallout as um, fella. Invoker Gray. Invoker Gray does major mods. Are you, made, are you still there, Invoker Gray? Have you made any mods lately that I can check out? Anyway, yeah, what are you feeling this now? The coffee, the coffee after the burn. Is, yeah, yeah, it's yeah. one off. Um. Yeah, it's actually. Yeah, What's it's the quite nice. like a chewy kind of like, like meditative on the flavors kind of beer? Yeah, it's got it's got like it's it's kind of like coffee triangles, but it's got going for it. And it's, it's nice, but it, it it's not like it's not upper echelon for mm. me. But it is nice. If if I had to bloody like, hell, Eric, you're putting yeah. out the big words now, man. What upper, upper echelon? Where did you learn that? Um, did you watch a documentary? Which I've got to decide all the big words here. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, no. I come out with the odd last word. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, uh, I probably scored a three, though. Like. Um, okay. So I reckon I'll go yeah. three as well. Yeah. Because we've learned this as well, haven't we? A few times. But when you're concentrating, thinking, of, overthinking it, you overthink it when you're trying to yeah. talk about the flavour. If you just drinking and having a chat with somebody yeah. and not concentrating on what or trying to focus on what you're actually feeling. We would enjoy this bit yeah. a lot more just yeah. than a normal case. It's because of the fact you yeah. overanalyze them, yeah. didn't you? Yeah. So a beer like this would probably like, yeah, no worries. Yeah. You know, even the ones I, I've noticed before when you we had a twelve pack because I always get the eight pack as well yeah. when you get a twelve pack. Yeah. So I drink my eight pack on my own and we, we share yeah. his twelve pack. And uh, I've always like even ones that I've not liked when we've actually analysed yeah. it. When I come to drink on this own, because you're not thinking about it, you're just drinking, you're drinking it. And you're like, it's all right. Yeah, yeah. you don't overanalyze it. Yeah. You don't over, you know. Yeah, hey, true. James. All right, mate. Yeah. I'm going to go free as well, actually. I'm going to yeah. go straight on the line with you. Now, I'm... Ugh. I could do a bit more maltiness, I think. So now, yeah. it's like a little bit too much coffee. Yeah, just like not enough much, like yeah. mouthfeel. It's just literally enough. Yeah. It's like coffee, and that's the. It's like a one trick pony. I've got some coffee. Yeah, and that's it. There's no kind of like any other kind of feel about it. You know, I can't remember who, who's go it is to go first. So I didn't know we even took it in turns. Well, we were sort of doing that, but like, we? well, yeah, but we don't know. Are we taking in turns? No, I don't know. Um, right, so I'm, you go then. I'll go bottom three. Bottom three. Um, it, it, it's quite hard for us um, to remember the eight when it's a 12 show. Oh, it yeah. ain't possible, would it? 
Um, damn, I don't. We should really make notes, but no. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Ooh. Oh. He invite. He updated my NPC. He made a character. Invoke a Grey made a great the Grey Man character in Fallout. So no, there's, 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 a, there's a character called the Grey Man. Oh, but apparently, cool. he can't die from friendly fire now. So that's cool. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> you need to make some more like exploring places for me to go and explore. Um, oh man, you know what? I've completely forgotten what the. I'm just going to guess. Really? Yeah, because I, I forgot. What was the one that I said was better than I thought? There was one that I said it was no. There was that. No, there was a, a light one that I was like, oh, this one I, I didn't mind. Oh fuck, man, I can't remember at all now. Literally got no memory. There was one, one of the light ones. Yeah. And I was thinking, oh, this might even make my top three. But no, nah, surely not. But it was like, no, definitely mid mid range. But um, there's one that I said, this is one of the nicest lighter ones I've, yeah. seen, I've had for ages. But I think, fuck no, I it think was. it might have been that. Yeah, I think it might be the wolf. Yeah, maybe. Fat knows. Um, the one was a severely hoppy one. I remember that. Oh, I don't remember, yeah. man. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make that one because yeah. it's got a bear on it and it's from China. Mm -hmm. So I put it in my bottom three uh, uh, without really remembering an awful lot about them, to be honest. <laughs> they were, they were like your, your usual. Yeah, your yeah. usual. That's it, really. I can't even put me in an order. No, I can't. Just no, I've it. completely forgotten. Right. It might even be wrong. I'll, I'll come yeah. back. If I ever watch this again in the future, but I hope for a second, I really like that one. Yeah. Or I didn't mind that one at all. I'm when just... you watch it back, you'll see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, I, if I ever do. Yeah. Top three? Oh, well, I thought you did your top one. Three. Okay, I can do that. Right. He can't remember the thinking. I can't remember so we always do it. You can't mark that one. You can't mark that one. That was good. The one that was like brutally hobby. Yeah, that's the brutally hobby. Is that a brutally hobby one? Yeah, so that's definitely my last. Uh, mm. That's one that was very on, on like grapefruity and orange. Do you remember? It was an orangey grapefruity. It was that one. See, I remember this shit. Um, Hazy Eye. Yeah, that's, I think that might be the one you didn't mind too much. And yeah, I. Oh yeah, <laughs> for like the cancer, that's, that's not a game. But yeah, definitely, I know, we're terrible, aren't we? Can you imagine when we do the 12 one? Sometimes you got to just yeah. like it for the can, you got to appreciate the can. Like, you know. Definitely, that's my last. Right. Because I remember that was just super hobby and a bit, a bit nasty, to be honest. Um, I go with that one, yeah. second from bottom, and that's a third from bottom. Okie dokie. Um, that's going to be my middle. That went too bad. Mm. Uh, obviously, I didn't drink. Sit here. Right. So I'll do my top, top Yeah, there. top three. Um, right, now, third place. Hmm. We this, remember our top one's a lot easier, don't we? Yeah. yeah. It's, it's this was, a, this was quite sweet. This is very yeah. sweet. And it was like it was, it was like more sweet than anything in, in, the, in a way. Mm. And it was a little bit, mm. but this one again it was like, mm, was this yeah. one that much? It's one. That, it's the one we didn't think was like had much going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna go with that one for number three. Mm. But yeah, it's kind of weird because, like, in a way, it's like they're, they're like they're different. Mm. So. But I just think like I like the style of this one more than the other ones, if you know what I mean. Yeah. So like, and I prefer the darker beers normally. It's just like it was. It was just like it felt like a constant sweetness after a while, uh, and then. Um, yeah, but it, is that not in your top three then? No, it's going to go three. Yeah, I made that three. Right. I made a number three. Yeah. I can't remember this one that much. Yeah. But maybe it could be number three, but it's like. Yeah. No, I can't remember enough to like to say it to be honest. It was the black one. No, no, actually, I'm much. not gonna make it number well, three. No, I'm gonna that's make, too much. I'm gonna make it number three. Yeah. Screw it, because that one was too sweet, and it was, uh, there's no abiding. I think I prefer like a no great shakes in either direction yeah. over a one that was too that. sweet. Yeah, you know, this that. one was a, not necessarily poor. No, no bells yeah. and whistles. No, like amazing, but like at least it's probably more palatable than that sweet yeah. one nonstop. Uh, this one wasn't bad. This one was my second. This one was um, 
the coffee kind of one, wasn't it? It wasn't yeah. too bad yeah. coffee. Yeah. There's a little bit, mm, but definitely for me, I, the number first one we drank, the raspy engine has to be my number one yeah. because I was expecting to get overblown with the raspberry. Yeah. And then I saw raspberry, I think, oh, no. Yeah. But it, it was done perfectly, wasn't it? It wasn't yeah. overblown. The raspberry wasn't fucking thrown in your face. It was like, yeah, you got some raspberry. But, oh, look, there's some other yeah. flavours here as well. It's not just raspberry banging you over the head. Yeah. You've got some maltiness as well. And actually, they kind of complement each other pretty well. You know, they, they sit yeah, yeah, yeah. good with each other. So that's definitely, definitely my number one for this week. I don't know why I've sung it for. You are my number one. <laughs> I think that's a song. It is now. It is now. Uh, well, my uh, top three in the same order. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I'm very close to having that as my number three, to right. be honest. But uh, that, that wasn't too bad. Um, and yeah, the coffee one we just had was yeah. uh, pretty nice. Yeah. Yeah, this was yeah. our first one. I thought yeah. was the best one we had, definitely. Definitely. Yeah. Raspberry yeah. engine. Yeah, I think it's okay. a mixture of the fact that I was kind of Rusty, wasn't expecting yeah. much from it. Yeah. And and then it, it like you know completely nice. delivered like in a, in a nice way. Like the yeah. good balance. There's a good balance of fruitiness yeah. and that kind of sweetness of the fruity raspberry with the the you know the yeah. proper old Bad school style kind of thing. Yeah, Bad I mean, you did four, me yesterday. Yeah. yeah, I forgot yeah. about that. Of course yeah. it's fucking number one. <laughs> yeah, definitely. Definitely. yeah, so that's it then. That's it. Yeah. We had fun. We did. Thanks for the people who, who hung out with us. Um, ooh, I'm going to go and play some Fallout now, I think, because uh, some drunken Fallout seems like a good idea. <laughs> and uh, we'll be back next month with some more beers. Yeah. Uh, cheers for watching, everybody. And don't forget, what's that thing we always say at the end of the show? Something's best. Oh, is, not... it, is, it, is it deer are best? Deer are best. Fear is best. Queers are best. Oh, uh, maybe. <laughs> oh, no. I know what it is. Beer is best! Beer is best, beer is best, and makes you fit, and makes you strong, puts more muscle in your dong bong pong, beer makes bonnie Britons, beer has stood the test, what did poor old Adam say to Eve, beer is best?